All right, my name is Matthew Avila, and today we're gonna be balancing these uh, these wheels because we just switched the tires on them, so we have to rebalance them now. So we start off by taking off the old the old weights. Make sure to, to get off any any leftover uh, adhesive. Right. Then, before putting it on the, the balancing machine, make sure you're using the right fitting. It should go into the, was it the wheel hub hole? It should fit about halfway through, so this one's fine. Once you have the wheel on, you want to get this, this, the specs. So it's already set up, but versus uh, we'll do the rim width. So we have this tool. I got around eight inches right here. Uh, 16. 16 set to 16 16 8 and then to check the offset to 4 4 4 inches all right now we we check the wheel for any imbalances you spin it till it beeps and then you let go let it spin on its own and then the machine tells you where you have to add the weights. All right, so it says right here on the on the inside of the wheel, we need to add 75, 0.75 ounces. So first, uh, before we add any weights, we just mark the areas where the weights are gonna go. Since this wheel is old and used, there's a bunch of dirt and grime that's that's stuck on the wheels, like brake dust and, and other stuff. And basically we have to clean the surface so it's it's nice and and clean so the adhesive for the the new weights can stick onto it better so we have to we have to clean it first we spray it with some degreaser on that side and we scrub all right so the areas are clean now and we'll just do a a, a practice weight placement all right so make sure you have the the right weight uh so this one calls for 75 70.75 70 ounces so each each little weight is uh 25 ounces they're called they call them quarters so three quarters 75 you add it to the edge Same thing with the 25. All right, so now that I have the test weights in place, we check the balance. And then this will let us know if we need to add more weights or we're good. It's zeroed out, meaning the tire's balanced. So now we have to actually put the weights on where they're supposed to go. To make it easier for us, use a marker to mark where the weights were so we can more ac accurately put the, the actual weights. So we just take out a little bit, make a line. And then that's where the weight starts. So, so when I put the, the actual weight, I'm gonna start putting the weight where the marker was. Now once you have your weight, you recheck the balance. And 
and it's zeroed out, meaning that the, the wheel is now balanced and did it correct. 